Hello, I'm Yue Pan. Today, I'd like to present PINs, a neural point-based thin representation unifying a Gaussian splitting radiance field and a sine distance field. Nowadays, robots use two classes of dense thin representations, the distance field and the radiance field. Distance field can support basic robot navigation, but for high-level applications requiring rich photometric information, a radiance field such as 3D Gaussian splitting is a better choice. For example, radiance fields can be applied in teleoperation, active reconstruction, and simulation for robot learning. In our previous work, PINSLAM, we used a neural point map to model the distance field with LIDAR. The distance field is then used for pose estimation and surface mesh reconstruction. In this work, we additionally integrate a Gaussian splitting radiance field into the neural points so that we can support all kinds of downstream tasks using a unified map representation named PINs. Let's look at this 2D toy example. In PINSLAM, we use a set of neural points storing shape codes to model the SDF. To additionally model the radiance field, we spawn k Gaussian primitives from each neural point by decoding its shape and color code. We optimize the spawned Gaussian by minimizing the difference between rendered and training images. With sparse training images, the optimization may converge to a local minimum, while the rendering is photorealistic but geometrically incorrect. To address this, we use the distance field to restrict the Gaussian primitives. We use Gaussian circles instead of the original 3D ellipsoids for better surface representation. Intuitively, we align Gaussian circles with the SDF0 isosurface and the circle normals with the SDF gradient direction to achieve a geometrically accurate radiance field. Likewise, when the LiDAR measurements are sparse and the visual data are rich, we can also correct the noisy distance field using the radiance field. In summary, we optimize the shape and color codes stored in the neural points supervised by the 3D losses from range measurements, 2D losses from rendering, and the consistency loss between both fields. We devise a LiDAR visual SLAM system using the proposed map representation. Here we show the SLAM process on the r 3 dataset, taking the LiDAR point cloud and images as the input. Our method is able to jointly build high-quality radiance field for novel view rendering and distance field for mesh reconstruction and pose estimation. We also built PINS map of Bone with our robot car. Now we show the rendering results from the PINS map. Here you can see the panoramic rendering and the neural point map we built. We show the RGB rendering on the top and the surface normal rendering on the bottom. And now we also show the surface mesh reconstructed from distance field on the left. From experiments, we validate pins can construct a better radiance field with higher RGB and geometric rendering quality. Our pins can also map a better distance field, which leads to higher mesh reconstruction quality and higher localization accuracy when applied to distance field based slime system. Thirdly, our pins map is elastic to map deformations caused by loop closure. We keep our radiance field globally consistent with all the duplicated artifacts such as the tree in the middle of the row. Besides, pins is more compact than the previous radiance field or distance field representations. We have released the source code of pins. You are welcome to give it a try. And thank you very much for your attention.